long day for me. I got up around uh, four o'clock and uh, went from Vienna to Bratislava. Uh, Bratislava is not far away. It's just about an hour, a little bit over an hour. And I didn't, I suppose, just to get on train there. Uh, a parishioner from St. Nicholas Church, in, uh, Orthodox Church in Bratislava, picked me up there. And uh, I was quite surprised to have this feel, to discover this atmosphere of Central Europe, something that I romanticized, but <laughs> I didn't expect to see. So it's the church, the Orthodox Church is in the 16th century church uh, that used to be a Roman Catholic church. And uh, actually there are traces uh, of the Russian and Greek community that existed there. For example, uh, Father Mikhail Diki, who was a rocker, he mandarin, in uh, South America. And then he left the Russian church abroad and became a bishop of Metropolia and was defrocked. So he was there a priest. Uh, and uh, overall, it was uh, this discovery of uh, another another layer layer of the empire that uh, doesn't exist anymore, which is Austro-Hungarian. To see this city uh, that used to be. Hungarian uh, city long time ago, part of the Hungarian kingdom on the border with the Ottomans when Hungary was for about 100 years in the 16th century under the Ottomans. So uh, actually then in the 18th century Orthodox faith was prohibited for locals. They have to be Greek Catholics. So it's very loaded, uh, loaded area, uh, and I'm not right now going on a train on a long uh, ride from Bratislava toward uh, the east. So I'm going to uh, the homeland of Metropolitan Lorus in Eastern Slovakia which is on the border in Poland. So I will be, uh, God willing, tomorrow at the Theological Faculty in Preshev there. Uh, and uh, hopefully we'll see the monastery in Vodnamirova. So uh, this is very moving and uh, special for me on the same level as it was when I went to see uh, Sremsky Karlovce. So I'm quite excited about all this and grateful and humbled. So I hope all of you are well and uh, uh, we'll talk to you soon. I hope. Bye bye.